No, I will not get a content strike against my channel by covering an Elvis song. Blue Christmas, 1978, directed by Kihachi Akamoto, starring Hiroshi Katsuno, Keoki Takashita, and Eiji Okada. A reporter gets wrapped up in a deadly conspiracy of intolerance and disinformation. After UFO sightings inexplicably turn the blood of all witnesses blue. In spite of having Christmas in the title, this is not a holiday film. This isn't like Die Hard, it doesn't even take place during December for the most part. Being a sci-fi film from the 70s, it explores sociopolitical themes and heavy topics. Don't pop this in expecting Star Wars, Soylent Green is more its speed and tone. The cast carries the film effectively, providing a compelling multitude of different perspectives for everyone affected by the events. The portrayal of Americans in this film is downright bizarre. The film features an entire montage with a bunch of oddballs the reporter finds on the streets of New York City. Interestingly enough, this is a Toho production. For those that aren't familiar, Toho is most well known for creating the Godzilla franchise. UFOs are mentioned throughout the film, but they only show up maybe once or twice, and it's very brief. The biggest problem with the film? The conspiracy is pretty weak, which makes the lengths people are willing to go pretty questionable. Verdict? Meh. This is not a film that will get you in the holiday spirit. It's actually pretty bleak and depressing. Nevertheless, it's a compelling cinematic oddity that explores some troubling aspects of humanity. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, have a wonderful new year, I'll see you in 2023 with another thrilling global adventure.